What's up, everyone? It's me, CN Teskoyima, and welcome to CN Figures, Figures in Your House. And for this tour review, we're gonna look at the Marvel Legends 2018 Column Sailor Figure Wave Ant Man. And this is my first time that I'm reviewing an Ant Man figure. But I'm gonna say this that this one is lame. No. The figure is not lame. I only said that because they didn't give him a lot of accessories. You see, they only give him like one swipe head, and he comes with the other leg of Column City. So, yeah, the box is lame because they didn't give him a lot of accessories. But the figure, he looks cool. Alright, so on the top of the box, it says Legend Series. And the bottom of the box, there's Marvel Ant Man the Wasp, and his name. Ant Man, and at the top in the box, you can see this kind of looking logo. I don't know what it is. The same logo that I came with Wasp, and here's the name of the Builder figure. And this side, you can see a nice, cool picture of Ant Man. Also, on this side, they look like well, both sides are the same picture. And here's another picture around the back in the box. And there's all the figures in the way. I really done reviewing Thor. Black Widow, Wasp, and Mannequin. All the only ones left is Black Knight. And there's the Bill of Figure. Oh man, my brother's gonna keep that one. But don't worry, I'm gonna get all these figures and build my own Bill of Figure. Alright, so there's nothing in the bottom side of the box, so enough chatting. Let's take this Giant Man out of his box. Or Ant Man. They're the same. There's Ant Man out of his box. And he looks sick, but when I took him out, his body mode, it looks just like the Marvel Legends Electro from the Amazing Spider-Man 2 film that he came out in 2014. The body mode of that figure and this figure, they almost look the same. I don't know why, but the detail on his color is really nice. I do like the color red. And the color black they added. And some pieces of gray or silver color all around. That's my little cracker. Okay, so. And look. I gave him a good pose to start the video. Ah, the little bird. <laughs> I love birds. But look at all the detail and the color of this figure. It's amazing. It looks sick. Alright then, so let's get on with the accessories. Ant-Man comes with one leg of coal, but remember what I said in my other videos when I'm reviewing the other wave. There's going to be a different video and a different review, so make sure you subscribe so you won't miss the review of this guy. And he doesn't not, he doesn't come with a lot of accessories, he only comes with two heads. I know that this head is a normal head, and this is the, the changeable one, but I believe like this one is the normal head, and this one's the swipe head. And they see they added some darker red color on his eyes and light color around here the on the mask, the red color I'm talking about. But it did amazing sculpting around the on his face, the mask, and also sculpting the bottle on the uh, I think it's darker gray color. And I do like these antennas they added. But he oh but he is both Ant Man and Johnny Man. So I do like this head sculpt. And here's the, uh, whoa, the swipe head without the mask. You can see they added some, well, the smile is kind of weird. They made it just like, they only made it like a line there. And his chin is a little bit, well, it's not pointy or any of that. And if they sculpted it, well, a little bit on the hair. And there's the ears. And they added some brown, well, I don't know, some gray color just like the hair color around his chin because it looks like he has a beard well he does has a beard but a little bit but this is a the actual head all right so now let's get back to the figure but first let me put this head back here's the figure again and look at that the flash of my phone is shining the red color here you see what kind of color do you use it's shining around the torso of the figure. Let me see around. 
and also from the back side it's also shiny by the flash on my phone how nice is that okay you see in the top of his neck they added some silver color lines and black lines around his throat and it is also they sculpted around the silver pieces around his shoulder here and more silver color here in each side and some silver color around here around the top of the torso and they added some black color here in the middle between the red color seeing a line and they added some silver color lines on the torso and each side and they also added a red dot in the belt and they sculpted nice with the belt here and they also added these red lines in each arm there and some silver color lines around the legs and each side and more silver lines here a lot of silver lines they added and also added some red color around his legs here and some red color lines between his black boots so that's pretty much it here they added a lot of red color they added a lot of, a lot of black color and also silver color or gray color the way you want to say it I have not seen not a single movie of Ant-Man or Ant-Man 2 but this song that he made appearance in the Civil War movie of Captain America and you can see that in the movie he turns to Giant Man because he's he's both Ant-Man and Giant Man I know that this is not Hank Penn this is Scott but I forgot his last name so yeah he turns to Giant Man in the movie that's what he is he's both Ant-Man and Giant Man like the Avengers, Earth Mighty Heroes, and Ultimate Avengers that he turns. Well, Ultimate Avengers that he only turns Giant Man. But Earth Mighty Heroes, he turns both Ant Man and Giant Man. I really like the sculpting on the eyes of the mask. Look at it. It's really nice. But the color red is also around my second favorite color. So I do like the red color eyes they add in the mask. Okay, that's really nice. But the Civil War movie, it was awesome, but I heard the Captain America, the Winter Soldier, then the first and the third part. But look at this figure, I do like the color and do like the paint ads, his articulation, alright, so his head, you can move it side to side, a, real, a little bit of rotation, he doesn't look up, but he does look down, and he also has some torso articulation waist articulation double jointed on his elbows and he can open his arms this much oh no not good some of the paint up scratch oh I had to take care of his figure and also his paint apps I had to be careful with his arm because he was in the box for a month almost a month all right so there he is he can open his arms this much a little bit of rotation on the arm. I already say you guys double jointing on the elbows. Some wrist articulation on each hand. Baby as well in each one. Oh yeah, I forgot. They also added some silver color on the top of his hands and each side. And they sculpted really good. It feels like a like a like a ball around the, on his hands. And he can do this split a little. He can kick this much, but it doesn't kick in the back. Double knee joint and some swivel on the foot and baby as well. But I'm not saying that this figure is lame. I only say it because he only came with only one accessory. Well, only two accessories or three accessories because. I really give the 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 bill of piece to my brother, and here's his head here. So you want to see him without the mask? So here he is. Here's Scott. But I don't know why they put Scott. You know that the original Ant Man and Giant Man was Hank Pink, but I don't know why they put Scott instead of Hank. They had to put Hank. But I haven't even seen the movies of Ant Man. All right, so I do like the head sculpt. Now let's do some comparing size.
Okay, Ant-Man stands around six inches tall height. And here he is next to the, the movie Mr. Fantastic. And I believe that Ant-Man stands taller than Mr. Fantastic or both of them stand in the same height. And here he is next to the Marvel Legends Wasp. And you can see that Giant Man is taller than Wasp. And here he is next to my fairy Mario Soled Juggernaut. And Juggernaut will always be taller than every figure that I have here. And there you have it. So thank you for watching this video. If you did, click that like button and subscribe if you want to see more of my toy reviews, my toy hunts. If you want to share this video, go ahead. And please follow my Facebook, CM Figures, and leave a comment, but don't leave any offensive comments or saying bad words. If you do that, your comment will be removed from this video. Alright, so thank you for watching. This is CM Teskayima and Adman, and we are out in line. Take care, be safe, happy holidays, keep on hunting, and keep on collecting. And see you next time.